Hi beautiful people, welcome back to this channel. This is Nana's Glam World. So today we're going to be doing Tafiti. Some people know her as a villain, some may know her as a hero. We're not very sure exactly what she was, but we do know that she was a benevolent spirit in Moana. So I've already started the look. Um yeah. <laughs> Um, so basically what I've done is that I've got, I've taken the got to be glued and stuck my eyebrows to my skin and powdered the area. And now the reason I'm taking a really light foundation shade is because, uh, taffiti, I'm going for the good taffiti, not the lava taffiti. And, uh, I'm just going to apply the foundation all over my face and the reason as i was saying that i took a really light foundation shade is because taffiti is green yes she is green in color and as you know dark skin normally washes away colors most of the time they tend not to be visible so i decided to put a lot of lighter foundation first and i used the revlon foundation and now i'm just going to apply this bright green color now I, I'll just um, um, apply it with like the back of my brush first and then continue uh, apply the application with a brush and make sure to use different shades of green because Tefiti is sort of um, representing nature and because she's representing nature, nature comes in various shades of green. We just don't have one shade of green. Now for concealer, just to brighten her under eyes, I will be using this green color corrector by LA Girl. Uh, but you see, ordinarily a green color corrector is usually used to rectify redness. But obviously because I'm a dark skinned person, redness is not really an issue with me. So I've just taken this opportunity to use that concealer before it expires. And that's what I'm doing. Make sure that anything you apply around your eyes should be eye friendly. Uh, that's the reason why I'm using this concealer because I don't think I have any paints or any colors that are eye friendly that can go directly around my eyes. So I've decided to use this green color corrector. It, the undertones to it are a bit different. It looks more of like a cool green. Uh, compared to Tefiti's very warm green but it will work because I'm just using it as an eyeshadow base and also as a brightener for my under eyes yes and I've just used a brush and a beauty blender to tap that in and now it's time for eyeshadow which is one of my favorite parts of this look and what when you look at Tefiti you notice that her eye sockets look a bit tired I wouldn't yeah somewhat like she has been through it and so that's the reason i used a really dark green eyeshadow uh, to apply on my eyes and i'm going to use the same color corrector just to clean the area and we also want to lift our eyes that's why i've gone for like a winged eyeshadow look
Now it's time for eyebrows and one thing that you notice about Tefiti is that everything about her is green. Whether it's her eyelids, her lips, her eyebrows, everything about her is green green what uh what's different is the shades of green so we're just going to be playing around with different shades of green just to make sure that everything comes into place so i'm just using this neon green eyeliner to just draw my eyebrows and as you can see it's a completely different shade from the eyeshadow that i used and also different from the um the paint that i'm applying on my skin now i'm just tapping in different shades of green onto my skin just to create like nature because as i said nature is uh, comes in all shades of green it doesn't come in one shade of green and then i'm going to further brighten my under eyes using that same la girl color corrector it's just a green color corrector but you can use a different shade of green for this step preferably a lighter shade because we want bright under eyes and then afterwards after applying the concealer i am going to uh dab it in using a brush and also using a beauty blender so that's what we are doing in this step we are using a beauty blender to just dab it in most of the time i usually use a brush first but it appears in this instant that i will only be using a beauty blender and not a brush first followed by a beauty blender mm -hmm. So for lips, I'm going to match uh, uh, again a different shade of green and I first applied concealer on my lips and then now I'm going to go in with with this NYX lipstick. It's one of the lipsticks that came from a holiday collection. I can't remember which one, but it's a dark green lipstick i've had it for the longest time i'm hoping that it's not expired but it didn't have any effect on me i'm not advocating that she is expired makeup but i have had it for a really long time and then now i'm just going to go in with a brush again and just tap in different shades of green again we want to create something that resembles trees and bushes and grass and all manner of nice beautiful natural things and so basically her lips are like that and what i'm going to do about the lips is that i've just gone in with a black liner all around just to make sure that they are more visible and i've also put on lashes as you guys can see i've put on lashes and i've also tight lined my waterline using a black eyeliner and I also used the Zaron Cosmetics Eyeliner to tight line the upper waterline. So I'm just playing around with colors, different shades of green and making sure that everything is nice and green like Tafiti. Now I'm going to do a little bit of contour and I'm using a darker shade of green. Actually, I'm using the same shade of green that I used on my as eyeshadow on my eyelids. Because it's a darker shade than her face or my face in this case, I'm going to use it as a contour shade to contour my nose and also to contour my cheekbones. And that is exactly what I'm doing here. I'm also going to go in with highlighter and I'm using the NYX uh, highlighter. And that is what I'm applying on the bridge of my nose and under my eyes just to brighten the area because she was glowing when she was. Tafiti was really, really glowing just before she went to sleep. And I'm sure she's gonna wake up like that. So I've just created uh, her, her classic, uh, you know, 
what normally makes her taffiti which is actually her hair is also green and also her crown the crown on her head it has flowers and it's also green and i've just used this christmas decorations as the head wrap as the crown and i've just put some flowers some artificial flowers in there painted some of them red and some of them white just like taffiti and i got this wig just cheaply off aliexpress so you have a beautiful